A urinary tract infection, also called a UTI, is the second most common infection affecting the urinary system, including the urethra, bladder, ureters, and kidneys. Most infections are found in the bladder and urethra, collectively known as the lower urinary tract. UTI occur when bacteria from the skin or rectum enter the urethra. Symptoms include frequent urination, feeling urgency, pain during urination, and a persistent urge to urinate even when the bladder is empty. Greetings, and welcome to Lively Living Tips, your go-to source for daily tips on maintaining a vibrant and healthy lifestyle. Join us on this journey to discover valuable insights that will allow you to sustain a lively living. The National Institute of Diabetes and Digestive and Kidney Diseases reports that about 60% of women and 12% of men will experience at least one UTI in their lifetime. Though UTI can impact on anyone from infants, children, and adults, women face a significantly higher risk, being 30 times more prone than men. It is because the female urethra, which is the tube that carries urine out of the bladder, is shorter than the male urethra, allowing bacteria to easily travel up to the bladder. UTI also are more common in postmenopausal women. Although urinary tract infections are uncomfortable, it is largely preventable and treatable. We have gathered few science-backed lifestyle modification tips for you today that might help you to prevent urinary tract infection. Number one, practice good hygiene. Maintaining good hygiene is essential to prevent urinary tract infections, and this holds true for menstrual hygiene as well. Whether using pads or tampons, it is advised to change them every four to six hours to mitigate bacterial growth. After using the toilet, thorough cleansing of the private parts, especially after passing stools, is crucial as the common bacteria E. coli originates in the anal region. Wiping from front to back is recommended to prevent the entry of rectal bacteria into the vagina or urethra. Researchers say that hot water is more likely to harbor bacteria. The soap used in bubble baths can irritate the urinary tract as well. That's why regular showers are more preferable over hot tubs or baths. Additionally, washing the genital area before engaging in sexual activity is important to eliminate bacteria on the skin, reducing the risk of introducing them into the urethra during sex. For infants, avoid prolonged nappy usage and opting for cloth nappies with frequent changes is advised to avoid trapping bacteria. Number two, drink plenty of water. Ensure adequate hydration by drinking plenty of water throughout the day. This practice is like giving your urinary tract a gentle rinse, effectively flushing out unwelcome bacteria. Some individuals may even resolve their infections only through sufficient fluid consumption. Health specialists recommend a daily intake of at least eight glasses of water or more for activities leading to excessive sweating. If it's hard for you to drink that much water, you can also increase your fluid intake by drinking other beverages. However, it's crucial to be mindful of acidic foods and drinks such as tea, coffee, and sodas which can irritate the bladder and heighten susceptibility to urinary tract infections. Opting for bladder-friendly options like sparkling water, decaffeinated herbal tea, milk, or smoothies, crafted from fruits and vegetables, helps maintain bladder tissue hydration and promotes overall urinary health. Number three, urinate regularly. When you don't urinate frequently enough, bacteria have more time and opportunity to travel up the urinary tract and instigate infection. So make sure you urinate every three to four hours or when your bladder feels full, as this helps to expel bacteria from the urinary tract and prevents their multiplication. Emptying the bladder before sex helps flush out bacteria residing in the urethra, while urination after sex eliminates any bacteria that may have entered the urinary tract. This preventive measure is effective in reducing the risk of urinary tract infections associated with sexual intercourse. Number four, eat cranberries. Some studies show that unsweetened cranberry juice can contribute to UTI prevention. Cranberries contain compounds called proanthocyanidins that prevents E. coli bacteria from adhering to the walls of the urinary tract and reduces the chances of infection. However, cranberry products have no confirmed effect on treating UTI once they have developed. So take them while you are healthy as a preventive measurement. Additionally, the presence of vitamin C in cranberries is believed to elevate urine acidity, potentially reducing the overgrowth of harmful bacteria, further contributing to UTI prevention. Number five, 
Consume probiotics. Probiotics are live microorganisms that stimulate the growth of beneficial bacteria in the gut, which contribute in maintaining a healthy balance in the urinary tract. Consume probiotic-rich foods like yogurt, kefir, sauerkraut, or tempeh into your diet. You can also take probiotic supplements or suppositories if you want. Number six, avoid irritants. Harsh chemical-based feminine hygiene products, powders, scented pads, or tampons, and douches can disrupt the natural bacterial balance in the vagina. Opt for gentle, fragrance-free alternatives to uphold optimal vaginal health. Number seven, wear cotton undergarments. Choose loose-fitting pants or skirts, especially during the summer, to promote air circulation and minimize bacterial growth. Avoid synthetic materials like nylon, which can trap moisture and foster bacterial growth. Opt for gentle fabrics, particularly cotton undergarments, as they allow moisture to evaporate, preventing a damp environment that can encourage bacterial proliferation and keeping the genital area dry. Number eight, use the right birth control. While regular sexual activity boosts your immune system, certain forms of birth control, if used regularly, may introduce unwanted bacteria into the vagina, which increase the risk of urinary tract infections. Avoid condoms or diaphragms with spermicidal lubricant as it can disrupt the normal bacterial balance in the vagina and urethra. Switch to a water-based lube for vaginal dryness. Consult with your healthcare provider about alternative birth control options suitable for your situation. Number nine, use estrogen replacement therapy if required. Postmenopausal women have decreased estrogen levels, which may result in the disruption of bacterial balance of the vagina, vaginal dryness, and increased vulnerability to urinary tract infection. Topical or other types of vaginal estrogens can help restore the area's pH balance, allowing beneficial bacteria to flourish. However, be mindful of potential risks associated with hormone replacement therapy, such as breast cancer and heart attacks. Engage in a thorough discussion with your healthcare provider to assess whether estrogen replacement therapy is a suitable option for addressing your specific health concerns. In conclusion, we can say, by adopting a proactive approach to urinary health through practices such as maintaining good hygiene, staying hydrated, timely urination, incorporating cranberries and probiotics into diet, avoiding irritants, choosing the right clothing and birth control methods can significantly reduce the risk of urinary tract infections. So, when was the last time you got tested for UTI? Subscribe and stay with us for a continuous stream of expert advice to elevate your daily living and embark on a path to a healthier you.